Alright, in this video I'm going to install a Camco roof vent cover on my RV vent roof and this will help to keep the rain out of the um, vent if you're away from the trailer and it starts to rain. This is made so it covers it up and it has vents on the inside and these do come out so you can clean it. And here's what the inside looks like. Turn that around. It's just like that. It has a mesh on it so that the bugs can't get in there. Um, so let's get this together and we'll install it on the vent. And so what they give you with the vent cover is a bag of hardware and these four brackets right here. And basically uh, the instructions say to attach the L brackets to these slots and measure it up. Make sure it fits around the vent cover nicely and square. And then you're going to mark like the position um, with a pencil or a sharpie on both sides. Alright, so what I'm doing is I took the front screen of this out and there's two screws. It come, screws come right out the Phillips screws. The vent comes down and uh, what you want to do now is line up all your metal brackets. And with the screen out of there you can see um, that the cover is positioned nice and evenly over the vent cover. And you want to get the brackets as close to the edges as possible. And what you're going to do is you're going to take like a pencil or a marker or something. Just mark the locations of the bracket holes. So then you can take the vent cover off and drill those brackets into the um, metal flange on your trailer. Uh, as the instructions say with the um, cover manufacturer. So I'm going to do that now. Alright, so I have the brackets installed on the um, flange. One thing that I did do is I tried to use some sheet metal screws to make it a little bit faster but that didn't work that great. The sheet metal screws I found start to loosen up so I did it the right way and I used the supplied um, nuts and bolts provided by the manufacturer and they made for a way, way sturdier um, uh, fit. One thing you want to keep in mind is you, know, you, don't, want, you don't want this to be loose because if the wind catches it you don't want it to rip off your trailer so you're better off just to go with the supplied nuts and bolts and now it's installed the roof cover, the vent cover. Alright, so I'm pretty much securing this to the roof. And what I did is you can leave these four bolts, um, snug them up by hand, leave them a little bit tight. And what you can do is you can slide the cover around on the brackets so it's centered. And then tighten down like the bolts on the side. So everything's nice and secure. And this is how far it opens up inside. It opens up like quite a bit, almost all the way. Um, so I don't see that being an issue at all. So now what I'm going to do is put the screen back in and there's three tabs right here that it slides into and there's two little Phillips screws at the top that it attaches to and then no bugs can get in there. Alright so when you're all done and the screen is installed uh, this is what your Campo roof vent cover should look like and can't wait to use it. Now we can leave the vent open and if we're out and about and starts to rain um, we don't have to worry about water getting into the trailer. Hope you liked the video. Please give us a thumbs up.